What is up everyone, hope you're all having a great day. Today I want to talk about my run with the crit guild on the Phalarx. That's the same run where I took the Inadental level cap and also tried to make some rounds or waves with the Phalarx on with the crit build. And I just found out what what went wrong and why wasn't I able to kill the demolishers and I talked specifically about the expired demolisher I was just not getting what was going on because I was not having enough damage and not healing the demos how I wanted to. I wanted them to just melt that wasn't really happen happening and after watching my videos I noticed it was completely my fault it was a just a rookie mistake, something that I don't usually do. And the thing is, I left my buffs wear off, especially the galvanized buffs from Galvanized Hell and Galvanized Savvy. Both were one maybe not even going, and the second one halved. And so that's what made my damage be much much worse than it should and I also didn't have the full stacks of the primary dexterity. That was just what what happened. As you can see right now the expired is running and you can see that my buffs are not all of them on the top of the screen. And that is just really really bad. Completely my fault and the, you're gonna be able to get this to level cap without a problem if you keep your buffs up. It's just something that I... A, a rookie mistake and both modes on this weapon are gonna be able to get the level cap. I, if I would choose, I would say that the... The crit build is more... I don't know, both, both builds have their inconsistencies but with the crit build you don't need to worry about armor removing. But the incarn mode with the crit build is much worse. It feels way, way less consistent. It's like, yeah, it's pretty crazy. It's too feels too too bad. I'm still gonna leave the all of these clips here and also what I recorded just after this these clips, which is me like having no idea what's going on. And yeah. Thank you very much for watching, don't forget to leave it a like and subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye! Alright, it's way 50, I'm using the Phalarx, or the Phalarx, I don't know how to properly call this thing, but yeah. The weapon is able to deal with level capped enemies. The build is pretty much more towards using this weapon. Uh, it feels a little bit inconsistent and I'm not really sure if I'm gonna even be able to finish this run now. But uh, yeah, with the primary fire is like no problem to, to kill the demos and stuff, but with the secondary fire, the incarnate mode, it just feels like it doesn't hold up. It feels like it's uh, it's missing damage, or it's on the way it's built. Of course, it's built for critical hunter munitions. It's too much dependent on the proc, and that might be what's holding it back. But the weapon, again, built for crit with the primary fire is just amazing it's a absurd amount of damage the only thing i felt is a little bit weird is against the expired demolisher and i really have no idea why because the expired is usually the easiest one to kill so i'm really not sure what's going on yeah also this is not the most usual run because i brought not only the arcs for this but also the inner them so I'm um, using both weapons to not most weapons to kill but taking both to level cap and okay, I think I'm gonna be missing a health here yeah I'm probably gonna die again because of uh, health issues yeah, let's see if I even have enough damage now build up to kill this one 
might not be enough damage. I'm missing some stacks, I think. Oh shit. Here comes a uh, shock axiomas to fuck everything up. Hopefully we're able to get it. Yeah. Still, I yeah the end the health drain is just too much. Maybe this is not gonna. Oh uh, yeah, I'm gonna extract now. Or this gets too bad. I mean it's already pretty bad, but uh, I think I can make it to extraction at least. Get revive is on CD, and I've been on this for too long. Look, take assault in action. Gonna have to run to the extraction. Hopefully, I don't die on the way. But yeah, this crit build might not be the best thing, but it is able to kill level cap enemies and also demos. I'm really thinking about working on a status build in using that 2000% damage increase when you don't crit that is a uh, one of the incarnate perks so yeah what did i uh, okay now let's take a look on the builds ash was going for the felarx so yeah this is the build Nothing too crazy. Phalarx build. Again, nothing too crazy. I'm not even sure if the, this Vigilante here would be the best thing. But yeah, I'm already kind of working on the non-crit build. Maybe I should have dropped Vigilante. In. I don't know, Blaze? What the fuck? No idea what should I have, I have went. But alright. Epitaph, same as always. Inodem, nothing too crazy. I've showed this build before on the Inodem video. Pretty, I don't know, decent, or if not decent, is just enough. Yeah. Then there is the Vask Cavat. I think I might have added a, a new forma since I've made the, the Vask Cavat video. But yeah, this is what it's looking like now. It, it's okay. <laughs>